From the air, lines of smoke show where lava is flowing through Leilani Estates as homes continue to burn. Up here in the helicopter, you can really get an idea of the scope of the destruction below. You don't see any firefighters down there because there is nothing they can do. This is an unstoppable force. The lava has consumed everything in its path, including trees and homes. It crept across the street and slowly enveloped this car. The eruption, you know, progress, a few more pretty extensive flows. Seems like there's a lot of magma under the ground and there's no sign of slowing down. At least 10 fissures have opened up in Leilani Estates, which is on the eastern slope of the Kilauea volcano. In some cases, the eruptions were so violent, lava spewed more than 200 feet in the air. At first glance, it may not look like the lava here is moving at all. It's cool. There's a crust on top. But if you look at the leading edge here on the road, it is slowly inching forward. Over the weekend, the Big Island was rocked by hundreds of earthquakes, including one measuring 6.9. Hawaii's largest in more than 40 years. It's like a Goliath, like a roaring jet engine. Sam Knox lives about 100 yards away from one of the eruptions. Why did you choose to stay? Because this is where I live, right here. I had faith, faith in, the, in the gods that my house was going to be okay. The lava is showing no signs of slowing down, and that's just one of the concerns here. The other is toxic gas. The lava emits sulfur dioxide. It can be deadly, and authorities say it's at extremely high levels in what they call the hot zone. Carter Evans, CBS News, Hahoa, Hawaii.